Good afternoon, everybody. Tech out here. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Dome Silk um, Premium Glass Screen Protector, Ultra Thin Glass Screen Protector for the Galaxy Z Flip 3. Um, they also make a version of this for the Z Fold 3. Um, and I got this uh, about last week from Whitestone when the phone came out. Um, and I was, I was quite scared to put it on because I was scared to take the factory screen protector off. Um, and they accidentally, they, they accidentally, I guess, sent me another one of these. So I finally. Um, decided that you know I have a backup if something goes wrong so I will go ahead and put this on um, and it's not anything to do with Whitestone that I didn't trust it was I didn't trust myself taking the other one off and I didn't trust myself putting this one on um, and I didn't want to be left without a screen protector um, I wasn't really worried about breaking the screen um, I saw some videos on removing it and it's just actually have it right oh no it's stuck to something um, it's, it's a pretty thin piece of like just flimsy plastic, almost like what you would get on the back of the phone when you get a new phone. Um, that's what it felt like. So it comes off really easy. You're not, you don't have to worry about like tearing the screen or anything like that really. Um, it came off pretty easily. I didn't have any issues with that. And um, Whitestone sends this installation tool right here. Um, so you just place your phone, I have a case on it right now. You just place your phone in there. Um, this is taller up here. So you put the screen protector up here and then on the bottom it's a little bit lower. Um, so it's slanted. And then there's the grooves on the top of the screen protector. So as you squeegee it on, it pulls itself down and everything gets lined up just fine. Um, no issues with that or anything. Um, the only thing you gotta be careful of is air bubbles. So you wanna make sure your screen is extremely clean. If you just removed your old screen protector, you shouldn't have any issues with that, but you don't wanna get any dust or anything on it um, or any particles. Um, and you definitely don't want to make uh, you definitely want to make sure you don't get any bubbles in the crease right here um, Because what's gonna happen is you have a bunch of air right here when you fold your phone uh, All that pressure right there with the air is going to crack the screen protector um, So you don't want to have that so definitely when you're installing it make sure you get those bubbles out um, I didn't do an installation video because like I said um, I, I was scared to do it myself. So um, Now that I've done it. It's not it's not hard at all. Um, it worked out really really well um, here's everything about the screen protector right here. I'll also link this down in the uh, description to where you guys can pick one up. Um, but I've used Whitestone White uh, products on all my devices from my iPhone um, to my Galaxy S21 Ultra and I have that um, now to my Z Flip 3. Um, this is actually a Whitestone case um, that was sent with this. So uh, just a nice back case protects the, uh, the back pieces right here. It's a nice thin case. I have their, um, their film on the always on or the uh, cover display right here. Um, so that is protected with the white stone film. Um, I actually just got the old screen protector stuck to the film I had right here um, and it, it ripped it off. So I had to take that off, but I'll, I'll replace that. Um, no fault of the product there. Um, I, like I said, I got the old screen protector stuck to it when I picked the phone up. Um, I peeled that off and it took that off with it. Um, but that is the Whitestone glass. Uh, not really a review right now, just kind of my installation experience. Um, it definitely does feel very glass like. It actually sounds like glass if you tap on it too. Um, and from what I've heard from other people, this is a lot more resistant to things like fingerprints. They're a lot easier to clean off. And it's also a lot resi more resistant to like scratches because it does have that ultra thin um, layer of glass right there. So that's very nice. Um, I will do a review on this after I've had some, had some time to use it. Um, but I just wanted to make a little video on my installation experience because like I said, I was kind of scared, uh, scared to install it. And at the end of the day, it really was not that big of a deal at all. Um, so Whitestone products, definitely recommend those. I will link them down in the description below to where you guys can pick one up. This has been Tech Out. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and have a great day.